8.15 a.m. Uh, nuts. Yeah. Well, bear with me, people. I'm still not quite awake. Hi there. Oh, hey, Minnow. Long time no see. Okay, come on. Let's go. Are you hungry? Oh, all right. Come on. Yeah, oh, yeah. So we're wandering into the woodlands here. Uh, to get these little critters fed. And I got one heck of a banger of a reincarnation video for you all today. Oh, yep, okay, hold on. Hold on, guys, hold on. Yeah, yeah, so we got our books out here. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's, <laughs> boy, you guys aren't starving now. Come on, here we go. Here we go, come on. Yep, and I'm not paying attention to what I'm recording, people, so just hey, come on. Hey. Hey, Minnow, you be nice now, all right? Come on, come on, here, here we go. Okay, so, uh, I got a little bit left here. I'm gonna go through, yeah, we'll throw it right there. So anyways, people, as I stated, we got one heck of a banger of a topic or topics to talk about today i'm gonna to wander back out here for a second I'll let those guys kind of munch down and <clears throat> so first and foremost you've probably been noticing my breathing here lately oh man it, yeah i say yeah smoking too much of the good stuff well it's not really the factor uh, first and foremost, we do have a little bit of fogginess or haze or whatever. You can kind of see it in the backdrop there. Uh, our skies are, of course, this white haze stuff. But over the last two weeks, I have been waking up with very congested lungs, very stuffed up nose. And this is a common complaint that I've been hearing from a lot of people as well as body aches and so on and so forth and as far as I'm concerned um, you know it's hard telling what all is being spread about in the skies up overhead but uh, uh yeah this and this is not you know springtime allergies although uh, typically twice a year I do get hit by uh, springtime allergies, if you will. Uh, when, when the cottonwood and dogwood trees start to uh, throw out their cotton, you know, the fluffies that float through the air, that's usually when I get hit. Well, that hasn't been the case this year. Okay, so, with today's topics, I was not planning on doing a reincarnation video this morning. But then I got watching the news, and there were some topics that I have to talk about. There's no two ways about it. Um, record temperature, record breaking temperatures. I talked about I talked about that a couple of days ago. That yeah, we'd be seeing those temperatures being broken. Okay. Um, pretty much hit the nail on the head with that one, but then that was kind of uh, expected anyways, and we more than likely will be seeing many more record-breaking temperatures in the U.S. in the upcoming days. It's a given. We got to talk of an arrest warrant out for Benjamin Netanyahu of Israel. Israel's going down. Uh, we'll get into that. And a lot of talk about Donald Trump this morning. We're going to jump into politics. What those 
writings in India speak of when it comes down to politicians and reincarnation. We're going to talk about prophecies. It's going to be, like I said, a banger of reincarnation video. And in some sense, once again, it's going to appear as a Sunday sermon. Remember, people, I'm bringing everything together. And... In some of the readings, <laughs> it's a little bit scary for me because it kind of hits at home. It's a little unsettling. I'm trying to come out with a message for all citizens of the world. There will be a new religion that comes about and it will be that of spirituality been predicted, it's been prophesized. May 27th, remember, 27, I have defined as being the number of trouble. I was born on the 27th. May 27th, yes. My birth date anniversary is soon to come within a few days. 57 years old. Ever since the time that I was seven years old, I was thrust into the realm of monsters, ghosts, demons. From seven years old, and for 50 years, I have been self-emerged into the unusual, paranormal, supernatural, the oddities, the anomalies, the phenomenons. I had things happen to me back when I was six years old that affected me so hardcore that it's taken 50 years for me to understand. And now, with the realizations over why I'm here, what is my purpose, and all that, <laughs> it's going to be revealed. I've been trying to reveal it to you all. And it's taken quite a few years for me to really understand myself what was going on. You might find out that much more in today's reading of reincarnation and the politics involved in reincarnation and the prophecies of politics. Some of you will not like this. Others will be intrigued. I believe all will have some type of interest into what I have to share. Stay tuned. It's on its way.